Hello friends, this is Ram Lakshmanan, architect of Y Crash. Today we are going to talk about the topic, you might be wasting millions of dollars in garbage collection. When someone is studying for the garbage collection, right, when someone is trying to study the garbage collection behavior, one of the key metric they study is called as a GC throughput, okay. So what does GC throughput mean, okay. Say suppose if someone says, my application's GC throughput is 98 percentage. What does it mean is, this application is spending 98 percentage of its time in processing the customer activity and 2 percentage of time in processing the garbage collection activity. Let me repeat, if someone says this application is 98 percentage throughput, it means this application is spending 98 percentage of its time in processing the customer transactions and 2 percentage of time in processing the garbage collection activity. Okay, so how does 98 percentage throughput sound to you. See, I don't know who coined this uh, GC throughput in terms of percentage is very, very clever, is very, very smart, but there is there is something deceiving going on. See, when, when someone says 98 percentage throughput, our human mind is trying to think it is a phenomenal throughput because 98 percentage means it's an A grade, it's an A plus grade. That's what our human mind has been trained to think. But it is really deceiving. Look at this. In one day, there is 1440 minutes, right? If someone says this application is having a 98 percentage GC throughput, it means 2 percentage is spent in garbage collection. 2 percentage of 1440 minutes is 28.8 minutes per day, which is close to half an hour. That means for half an hour, your application is pausing. For half an hour, your application is freezing. So any transactions that comes during this half an hour window, they are not going to get back a response. That means in terms of one year, it means 7.3 days per year, your application is not responding. It means your application has gone on a holiday. See, uh, say it, it is even worse than going on a holiday. Say suppose if I go on a holiday, that means there are other peers in my organization who will do my job. Whereas in this garbage collection, what it's doing is, if if this garbage collection is running, there are not others to cover up for, for you because this application is pausing, the application is sleeping. It means I'm being paid to do my work, but I'm, I'm basically, I'm sleeping in my organization, right? Which is very bad. So let's see what is this translates in terms of dollar value. Let's focus, let's say your application is having a 98 percentage throughput. It means in one day, it's not going to do any work for 28.8 minutes. But for this 28.8 minutes, you need to pay to your cloud provider because cloud provider doesn't give you any discount if your application goes on a garbage collection. So I, for, for our math, I took an uh, Amazon EC2 instance, a T2 2x large 32 gig Red Hat Linux uh, instance, whose cost is 0.57 dollars per hour, right? Say suppose you are a mid-size organization and you are running on a thousand EC2 instance, and let's say your application's GC throughput is 98 percentage. That means for the two percentage multiplied by these thousand EC2 instances for one year, you end up paying 100,000 US dollars to your cloud provider, but you're not more, you're not going to get any return on that. If you are if you are a large organization who is running on a 10,000 EC2 instance, that means you are looking at wasting one million US dollars. If you are a very large enterprise who is running with 100,000 EC2 instances, then you are looking at wasting 10 million US dollars every single year. Assume if your throughput is 95 percentage, that means and, and very large organization, they are wasting 25 million US dollars per year. See, 95 percentage is still considered as a good throughput in industry, sadly. But I've seen uh, applications who's having a 90 percentage throughput, 85 percentage throughput, 80 percentage throughput. Then think how many millions of dollars those enterprises are wasting. See friends, a very sad and a very unfortunate truth is, a lot of enterprises are wasting these many millions of dollars without even knowing that they are wasting, right? Enterprises, they are trying to reduce the cost in several areas, but there is a big area here which can be optimized, 
but they didn't even a lot of enterprise doesn't even know they are wasting these many millions of dollars right so what what we can do what can we do about this there is couple of things we can do the number one is we can tune the garbage collection performance right with proper gc settings with adjusting various parameters you can improve your gc throughput say if, if your today's gc throughput is at 85% you can optimize it and get it to 95% 98 99% you can optimize it. that is one thing that you can do the second thing is we as a developer community we uh, right now uh, in the description we i'll publish a white paper which shows even a very highly celebrated frameworks they waste exorbitant amount of memory because of inefficient programming practices today as a development community we all can come along to write a memory efficient code if you're creating less object it means less garbage less garbage means less uh, pauses right and it will result in a phenomenal cost saving and you are reducing your overall compute capacity which is a green economy that what entire world is aspiring towards heading towards and we all can be a part of it okay friends thank you very much for watching this video